Regan Gascoigne has been cheered on by his dad Paul Gascoigne throughout this series of Dancing on Ice. The 26-year-old dancer is one of the favorites to lift the trophy tonight while competing against former Strictly Come Dancing professional Brendan Cole and Pussycat doll Kimberly Wyatt. Regan, who has partnered with pro skater Karina Manta, has even left famous father Gaza wiping away the tears with his beautiful routines. Proud dad Paul has been spotted watching his son in the studio audience along with Regan's sister Bianca Gascoigne, who revealed their dad broke down watching him skate. However, Gaza won't be in the studio tonight to watch the final of Dancing on Ice, because his son has picked two other guests. Paul has been in the audience multiple times across the series but Regan has decided to bring sister Bianca and mum Cheryl instead. Get the news you want straight to your inbox. Sign up for a mirror newsletter here. Cheryl and Paul's high-profile relationship began after they met in 1990 and they got married six years later shortly after Regan was born in 1996. The footballer adopted Cheryl's two children from her first marriage to Colin Kyle, named Mason and Bianca, who then took Gaza's surname. Cheryl had a turbulent marriage with Paul that ended in divorce in August 1998 after only two years. Regan's dad Paul has thanked his ex for keeping their son on the straight and narrow while he was growing up. He's got a strong mum, she's strong because she's obviously been with me, Paul told the Mirror in January. And when it comes to Regan following in his dad's chaotic footsteps, Paul has no worries, saying, he's got a good head on his shoulders. He won't be like me. Also in the studio will be Bianca, who claimed she was the proudest sister in the universe after watching Regan skate. The former Love Island star did confess that seeing Regan doing so well on the ice can be bittersweet because of the horror injuries some of the celebs have suffered. Watching Regan on the ice has been difficult too because there have been some nasty injuries on the show, like skin being sliced open and breaks and sprains, Bianca told Closer magazine. I'm always on the edge of my seat because I know he could really hurt himself, it feels slightly bittersweet. Gaza knew his son wasn't going to follow in his footsteps from a young age after he turned his back on football boots and opted to buy ballet shoes instead. Paul said, yeah, he was going to do his dancing lessons in London and I did have a little sly look in and just choked up a little bit watching him dance seeing how good he was and how much he enjoyed it. It got me emotional seeing him enjoying himself. And after seeing videos from dancing on ice training that he's showed me, he's good, he can win. Regan certainly inherited his dad's fancy footwork as he enrolled into the Hammond Ballet School and then went on to study musical theater at Dring Park School for Performing Arts. While you might imagine Paul could have been a touch gutted that his son didn't take up football, it was actually the very opposite. I think Dad didn't care that I wasn't following in his footsteps, Regan told the Mirror earlier this year. He just wanted me to be happy. He wouldn't force me to do something that I wouldn't want to do. Do you have a story to share? Email web features at trinitamirror.com.